First of all, my previous upload about atheists being more intelligent than religious people was a report I saw in our Daily Mail, and there is something on the internet about it. And uh, it seems most people are agreeing with me that uh, atheists are more intelligent. There's only about two. Sam, obviously. No, I'm not trying to upset you, Sam. You know, Sam, obviously, and someone else. But most, some people are, are sitting on the fence, not making a comment. Well, they're commenting, but not saying whether they agree or disagree. But uh, many people are agreeing with me. But anyway, moving on. Uh, the chemical trails are being laid over Nottingham again. Now, I'm always outside on the balcony, as you know, smoking, and I just sent a report to a Nottingham group who are investigating the chemical trails, and I've told them tonight at 9.30 on the 19th of August. <coughs> There's a full moon and the sky has been crisscrossed with these chemical trails. Now I see aircraft every day travelling as I look south from my balcony, travelling from kind of uh southeast or south direction to west. Aircraft going over to the USA and coming back. These chemical trails are being laid from a kind of uh, southeasterly direction, but not heading west, they're heading northwest, so they're disappearing behind me over the court. And uh, condensation trails, of course, I see them all the time, and they dissipate as soon as the aircraft have passed, but the condensation these chemical trails do not uh, dissipate they just sit there and one was that wide it was covering the full moon and uh, the aircraft appear to be very high and flying very fast and as I told this group one, one day last year during the day I saw two white aircraft coming from a, a southerly direction to a northerly direction, so they were approaching me as I was looking south. There were two white aircraft flying side by side, one slightly behind the other, and they were laying thick white chemical trails. And uh, after they disappeared over the court, out of my view, those chemical trails started to get blown uh by the westerly wind, so they widened out, uh, you know, and uh, condensation trails, they just dissipate, that's the word, yeah, but chemical trails don't. So it started again, and uh, we've got some fine weather coming, and I shall have my camera ready tomorrow. I told this group, unfortunately, I haven't got a night vision camera. No, and it's they're monitoring the weather, uh, something to do with global warming. There's no such thing as global warming. It's climate change, climate change. Anyway, yeah, so that's it. So, uh, yeah, bingo again. Didn't win anything. Not a sausage, nothing. Oh, God, everybody else is winning. Why not me? No, but anyway, I should persevere. Mm. And of course, this chemical trail laying, it's all over the world, uh, more so in America than the UK. Uh, there's plenty of videos on uh, YouTube about it. So I should be watching out. I'm going out again after while this uploads and have another look at these aircraft I've heard that they do operate from Boscombe down to the south of the UK I have delivered there in the past when I was on the trucks and uh, they that's where they're supposed to operate from but I once saw I've seen videos where the aircraft are on the ground and they've got the big sprayers on the back each side of the aircraft and inside the cargo aircraft they've got huge tanks of this these chemicals
And uh, they're not condensation trails. I'm not stupid. I can tell the difference between a condensation trail and a chemical trail. Yeah. Well, alarming. Right. So that's it for tonight. And people are agreeing with me that, uh, but I won't care about that, you know. Uh, they agree with me that uh, non believers are more intelligent than believers as far as religion is concerned. Uh, they can be, can be. Not everyone, obviously. Someone will say to me, I can tell you that there are many, many people who will disagree with you, Arthur. And I can say, and I can assure you that many, many people will agree with me. So, you know, just start a topic of conversation. As I've often said, YouTube and Facebook is all about exchange of opinions. And whether I'm right and whether I'm wrong, well, you know, it's at least something to talk about, isn't it? All right. Bye. Come on. Bye.